Hey everybody, Jackie here. It is, I believe, week 28. Thank you so much for tuning in for another installment of my update and what I'm learning and what I want to share. This week, I splurged, but I thank goodness I haven't suffered, at least in the numbers yet. I just went ahead and did my weight and did my measurements, and I'm still losing inches. Yay! For the entire year. I think it's about 17 and a half pounds, and it's about... I don't know. I forget the inches. But they add the inches. They like add your, I do chest, waist, hips, thigh, and um, forearm. So whatever. But this is the basically um, a few things that I, too many dogs barking today. <laughs> um, a few things that I wanted to share today is for you to stay focused. For you to have a goal, to have a plan, and do the best thing that you can do to get there within your resources. I finally just posted on my page, uh, Coach Jackie, on Facebook, that that exact principles. Because I think too many people think that I'm going to force you to buy a product. Too many people think I'm going to force you to do a certain thing a certain way and, and fall into a, a funnel and, and all these things. I can't. I can't because I know on my personal journey, no one else, even my mentor, my coach, knows I have to do what I have to do to stay successful, to stay consistent, to make it a lifestyle. So think about a few things. Let me just give you a few more things. So again, get your goal, get your plan, and do it. And do it the best you can do. Next, look at what you are eating, look at your activity, and the last two real key um, healthy habits is water and sleep. I'm doing very good recently in the sleep area again. I was starting to stay up late and finally I kind of woke up early one day to make me go to bed early when the next that next night. And then water. My water's out okay. De-stressing, doing much better with that, not letting things bother me anymore. I can't control it. I can't control it. So food, fitness, sleeping and water, and then of course de-stressing, no stress, say no to things, let things go. So um Get those things. Find your strengths. Maybe you're good in water. Maybe you're good in sleep. Maybe you're good in eating. Maybe you're great in fitness, but you're terrible at eating. Whatever it is, pick the strengths and put them to the side. <laughs> Find your weaknesses and let's work on those. I am very strong in resources. I may not be able to cure you or fix you, but I'm definitely 100% guarantee that I will support you, that I will be cheering you on. Not just today, not just in six months, but in a year or more from now. I have been on this journey since 2011, reached healthy by 2013, and I have been maintaining ever since, successfully, even through a two feet surgeries and travel and a few splurges. I have maintained an amazing quality of life. And isn't that what we're all going for? A quality of life. Let's increase your quality of life through healthy habits, through healthy living. Everyone has a different definition of healthy, okay? A little quotes out here. But everyone just defines it very differently. And I can't say enough that functional medicine works. I am proof of that, of more natural things, of I guess it's holistic nutrition and things like that. But honestly, I just finally you know, learned and realized GMOs are the real deal. They're awful. I learned there's too many myth health foods out there as well. So <laughs> I'm so serious today. <laughs> so message me, comment below. Let me know your healthy habits. What is your strength? Message below, is it, is it food? Is it fitness? Is it sleeping? Is it water? Or are you good at de-stressing and letting go? Message me below. Make sure you like this video. Make sure you share this video and make sure you subscribe. It's free. All of it's free. I'm here to love on you and, and support you unconditionally because support increases success. Bye-bye.